Ladies and gentlemen, guys and gals, how's everybody doing today? I hope everybody is doing well. It is, um, dang, what is it already? January, February, Mar. It's March 16th, 2020. For some reason, I was about to say February. Um, oh, I clicked on the, the wrong the wrong thing. There we are. There we are. What's up? Uh, all right, so um, day, uh, technically day one of quarantine. I don't know if that word's going to get me demonetized. YouTube's been going really, really ham with the demonetization. Like, ch ch you get demonetized. You get demonetized. Anyway, uh, if you just found my video or on my live stream and you're not familiar with who I am, what I do, what this is, this is the uh, the Daily Mining Live Show, so to speak. It is Monday through Thursday. 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time live. Uh, but if you're watching this after the fact, I'm glad you made it here anyway. Come and join us live anytime. Uh, I want to thank everybody that's come out so far. Um, we have Serpent, Mr. Nefarious, Derizzle, Mr. Daniel, Batman, Jay Keen, Serpent. Uh, I think I said Serpent twice. Savage Mind, what's up, man? Batman and Savage Mind chilling together right there. Mr. Walter, Ozzy Bogan Tech. Jay Keen, Jeff N, Dan the Dane, Nick Gra Gralalas, the Rizzle, and uh, just Batman again. Okay, so welcome early birds to the live stream. We are going to be talking about some stuff today. Obviously, um, the title is just pretty much a joke. It's uh, invest in Bitcoin or toilet paper. That's due to the fact of the current... Um, I don't want to say the the name of the sickness that's going around because that will guarantee a 100% uh, demonetization uh, flag on my video. But the sickness that's going that the sickness that that shall not be named um, is going around, and it seems like uh, in my town and a lot of other towns around me, cities, states around me, everybody is buying all the toilet paper. Um, I don't understand it because technically this sickness doesn't directly relate. To downstairs like it, it makes like you know like coughing and and upper respiratory stuff it's not like like you blow your your bottom out uh but it, people buy what they buy so so be it um i mean if you were in if you had stocks and in, in toilet paper companies you're probably doing pretty good right now um just to say it and get it out of the way even though you probably already guessed this is not financial advice blah 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 you know what how that goes um, what's up, Dan the Dane? Well, glad you can make it. Glad you can make it. Da Rizzle, what's up, my ninjas? Yo, Brandon Coin, I got TP for the gram. Twenty bucks a gram. Okay, TP by the gram. I don't know how that works, but that's that's expensive price. <laughs> oh, SF Visual Tech said stock up on Bitcoin, and not toilet paper. It's way cheaper. Yeah, yeah, toilet paper is skyrocketing right now. Um. It's the human malware virus. Yeah, yeah, that's what, um, uh, what's his name was calling it? They're going, Gamers Nexus, human malware. They're buying it up all here too. Yeah, it's, I think that's happening everywhere. <laughs> Colin says you can't wipe with Bitcoin. That, you are, you're true. You're right. If you got your paper wallet though, you might be able to wipe with that. So. Anyway, um, before we get started, I wanted to give a huge uh, shout out and thank you to uh, the members of the channel. These are the guys that have joined and are directly uh, participating in uh, keeping the lights on and keeping the bills paid, and it's much appreciated. If you're interested in joining, there's a join button down below. It, um, it, it helps. It definitely does. I feel it. But uh, those guys are a part of the Miners Club, or Yashnik, Frankie Two Times, Crypto Mining Tools, Savage Mine, Red Panda Mining, and Just Mike. And then the Legends Club is Done One Too Many, Lightbulb, and Mr. Batman himself. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, so we've been going for a month now. Um, we're, we're, doing, we're going strong now. Um, let's, uh, let's take a look at a little bit, a little bit of what's going on in the news. Um, oh, what's up, Ozzy Bogan? Seven days now where I'm at no TP went where. Okay. Lawrence Coheen, cheers, welcome to the live stream. Done one too many, nice of you to make it. I'm glad you could join us. Oh, there's no toilet paper anywhere for the last seven days. Be careful, Ozzy Bogan, don't get too far away from home then. Uh, Disco Biscuits, Bitcoin could buy you toilet bidget attachment. Oh, I don't know about that. 
toilet bidet. Uh, you think Amazon sold out of those? I, that's that's like an overseas thing. I, I don't know about it. Anyway, Bitcoin trades below production costs. Miners are better off buying. This article was posted today. Um, and I thought it's it's pretty relevant because a lot of us are mining. A lot of us are not mining Bitcoin, but um, when Bitcoin miners aren't making money, typically uh, altcoin miners are not making money. So let's check it out. Bitcoin recently experienced a historic, historic single day drop, taking the cryptocurrency from 7,500 to under 4,000 in less than 48 hours. Ugh, we felt that. Uh, the first ever cryptocurrency is now trading below the cost required by miners to produce each Bitcoin. Now that miners are better off buying BTC outright, what could this mean for the strength of the underlying network, the assets future, the upcoming halving, and the price of Bitcoin? Well, guys, that halving is coming and the price just halved in preparation for it. So now the price can uh, double and it'll be back to 10000 Woo! Okay, that's a bad joke, I know. But uh, anyway, Bitcoin falls under cost of production. Bitcoin may be in its most dangerous position yet, following one of the assets' worst 24-hour drop in short in in its short 10-year history. As a as the stock market melts down, the human malware shuts down all human activity. Bitcoin and the rest of cryptocurrency market also tanked as the globe entered a state of lockdown and panic. The drop took Bitcoin from 10,500 just a month ago to 7500 and then below 4000 just days ago. That was literally like Friday. We it's still fresh. The wound is still fresh. The crypto asset is trading around 5000 at the time of this writing, which is still well below the cost to produce each bitcoin. The underlying bitcoin blockchain protocol is powered by a process called proof of work, which involves miners using computer processing power to make complex calculations to validate each new block. The reward for doing this that miners receive is BTC, Bitcoin, but there's an energy cost associated with operating miners that must be considered. And if that cost is higher than the value of Bitcoin, miners would be better off buying the asset rather than running rigs and continuing to power the network. That's exactly what happened now that Bitcoin has fallen to such low prices. It's at the point where even on the cheapest end of producing each Bitcoin, miners would still struggle to be profitable at current prices and are better off buying outright. Post having HE double hockey sticks, miner metrics suggest the worst is yet to come. According to the current cost of production on the highest end, it costs around $8,000 and on the low end, it costs roughly $4,800. Wow, some people are, are taking huge losses on mining Bitcoin right now at that uh, 8000 range. That implies that most miners are currently running their machines at a loss. I think everybody on board or everybody in the live stream agrees that uh, yeah, we're we're pretty much mining at a loss. The cost of production is also to is about to rise significantly within the next two months. While the halving was expected to be a bullish event caused by the supply and demand to be thrown off in favor of skyrocketing prices, it very well could end up being bearish this time around. The halving cuts the reward miners receive in half. This means that in just two months when Bitcoin's halving rolls around, the cost of production will double overnight, taking the aforementioned prices to 16000 on the high end and 9600 on the low end. Yeah, that, that's, that's a little bit. Mining difficulty will increase as miners shut off their rigs and eventually the cost to produce Bitcoin each will lower to compensate. Um, hold on, sorry, I was turning my live chat on. Uh, another metric that follows mining activity are Bitcoin's hash ribbons. In the past, these hash ribbons have signaled when miners are about to capitulate and following this, normally a huge buy signal for Bitcoin. Boom. Boom. I guess those are ribbons. Miners capitulated in late 2018 and again in late 2019. The hash ribbons are currently curling downward and with the cost of production so low, miners could capitulate again, causing yet another massive sell-off. The only positive amidst the negative outlook related to Bitcoin mining is that after destruction ends, a buy signal usually takes Bitcoin to an all-time high. So, once we get all the way down in the bottom, we will go and set a new high. That'll be awesome. I'm, I'm excited about that. Um, during the past Bitcoin cycles, the hash ribbons had three major phases of capitulation before the new bull run triggered. Bitcoin had two, and then the next major miner capitulation could be the final shakeout before the next bull run finally kicks off. I'm ready for it. I'm ready for that bull run to kick right off. 
Who else is ready for it? Um, Serpent. Brandon, I would join the members, but I am working on buying a house during this market downtrend. Oh, as Serpent. My videos and live streams are definitely 100% free. It's only if you wanted to, um, if you wanted to help. And if you want to help but can't afford, I, I totally understand it, man. Um, love, for sure. Dan the Dane. Denmark. A lot of toilet paper. No milk. Okay, so uh, up in Denmark, um, they're they're drinking the human malware away uh, with milk. The Rizzle, it's ridiculous how bad the toilet paper game is. Keep mining the coins and remember to all ETC rewards are about 1,200 blocks away from reduction. Thank you for that. AZ, what's up, man? Welcome to the live chat. Batman said, Dan the Dane, trade you toilet paper for milk. Heard that, Batman. Disco biscuits, toilet paper for milk is a good offer. You can make bread with milk, right? No, no, no. You have to have milk and bread to make milk sandwiches. That's what people in the South eat whenever it snows. You get milk and bread. Boom. Milk sandwich. It's actually a joke. It's not a real thing. Um, but it, it, people do buy milk and bread uh, when it snows. It's, it's like the weirdest thing ever. Um, the cost of mine in China is about 3200 for each Bitcoin, except for students using free power. I think most a majority of the miners are not using free power. Yeah, free power people are always in profit. They can mine with anything. With anything. Uh, Ozzy Bogan, solar power for me. Have four kilowatts. Very nice. Buy low, sell high. It's not a bad time to buy right now. We're seeing a lot of red. Obviously, this is not financial advice, but I am personally investing into um, into bu like buying. I'm buying, and I normally don't buy. So yeah. That's uh, not something I normally do, but I'm doing it. You know what I'm saying? Um, what's up, Yashnik? Welcome. Welcome, Batman, Donald, Walter. Hey, hey. Serpent, I believe this new level is similar to the last bottom of 3200. So if you zoom out, it's in higher low, not financial advice. Thank you for that, Serpent. Much appreciated. Um, well, while we take a look at this, and we're also going to take a look at what the, the graphics cards I have running are making, um, I'd like for you guys to get your Ethereum address because the mystery man is back. Mystery man hit me up and he was like, hey, I got some coins to hopefully make some people feel better about the current situation in the market. So I'm going to take y'all's temperature real quick. Do any of y'all have the human malware? Nope, everybody's good. Everybody's good. Hold on. Well, I might have it, actually. Anyway, um, yeah, so Mystery Man's back. We're doing a giveaway at the end of the live streams. We're going to start off with uh, 0.2 ETH, 0.2 Ethereum. So go ahead and get your Ethereum addresses, drop them in the live stream, and then when this video, or when this live stream's over, sorry, drop them in the live stream. When the live stream's over, which is going to be here in the next 15, 20-ish minutes, give or take, uh, we're going to do that drawing uh, for Ethereum, not Ethereum Classic, guys, ETH Ethereum. So, And always make sure to drop a big thank you to the Mystery Man in the live chat. Uh, SLS Energy, hey Brandon, what's up, man? Oh, just chilling, man, and enjoying this uh, temporary, mandatory, voluntary quarantine we got going on. I went to work today. Um, apparently, uh, my, my job doesn't understand that I'm quarantined, so... I had to go to work, but then I came back home to, to continue my quarantine. I'm a quarantine for probably about the next 10 hours, and then and then I got to go back to work tomorrow. But then I'm going to come back, and I'm a quarantine again after work. So you know how it goes. Um, Nefarious says, my wife, my wife has one friend and one patient. She's, she's not seen either in three months, so safety there. Okay, good stuff. Disco Biscuits, great time to try and get enough ETH to stake later. Good stuff, yeah, much appreciated. All right, so yeah, drop your Ethereum addresses. Let's take a look at the market real quick. Uh, Bitcoin currently today, as of March 16th, 2020, 10, 15, 10, 16 Eastern Standard Time PM. Bitcoin's at $5,016. Let's get a good refresh on that. Oh, sorry, $5,160, so... Ooh. Come on, Bitcoin. We need you back, bro. Um, let's see here. Ethereum's at $115. Yeah, everything's just... It's just a sea of red. Uh, XRP Ripple, $0.14. Cents. Bitcoin Cash, $176.74. Uh, 
Litecoin right behind it at $33.92. Yes, got, ladies and gentlemen, we have a $30 Litecoin again. Like, I never would have thought. What? $30 Litecoin. Tezos, $1.37. Tron, 0 0.009 cents, so almost one penny. Chainlink, $1.87. Monero, $34.63. Ethereum Classic, $4.57. Uh, further on down the list, uh, Basic Attention Token, $0.11.5. Cents. Finance USD Coin, $0.98. Cents. Bitcoin Gold, $6.14. Decred, $9.46. Everything's just red. I mean, there's a couple green stuff, things in here, but I don't, I don't know what they are. Uh, Raven Coin... 1.2 cents bitcoin diamond 39 cents it is not a bad time to buy if you've ever thought about investing in literally anything steam 13 cents holo 0. 0.0002 cents nervos network 0. 0.003 cents horizon four dollars 69 cents um komodo 28 cents verge a uh, tenth of a penny wow Z coin two dollars ninety seven cents, uh, and I guess that rounds out the top one hundred at Pundi X at point zero 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 one cents. So, here is the chart of the graphics cards I have up and running and at the current market. Obviously, they're down even more than what they were uh, just the other day. Uh, I'll let you guys take a look at that while I I start filling in a a um, Excel sheet with all these uh, Bitcoin addresses. Sorry, I can't talk. Boom, it looks like the first one is Mike Blades. Thank you for that, Mike Blades. Thank you for entering the, uh, the mystery giveaway. Let's see here. Uh, there we go. Let's blow that up. Mike Blades. Who's next? Mike Blades. They're extending grocery store hours. LOL. Only the rich get to take off work for three more months. Hmm. Donald Walter. Thank you for joining in to the, uh, the giveaway there, Walter. W-A-L-T-E-R. Walter. Alrighty. Who's next? Oh, oh, what did I click? Where did it go? Did I stop the live stream? Uh, Darizla. Alrighty, where are we at? Oh, nefarious uh, Serpent. Thank you for entering Serpent. Make sure it is the Ethereum Classic address, guys. Nefarious says the police escorted the lady that got the last rolls of toilet paper from Sam's Club today to ensure ensure she didn't get hurt. Wow. They walked her from the back of the store to the checkout and then to her car. Is it getting that bad where you're at, Nefarious? <laughs> AZ, just, just trust the longevity of LTC. Serpent, the Red Sea markets have rend on them. I can't... The curse, if anyone gets my references, I, I didn't catch that. A nervous is going to tank in value as all these new ASICs hit it and the miners start dumping their coins. Uh, Serpent, don't use mine, Brandon, not a BTC. It's an ETH address. We're doing, oh, okay. Yeah, we're doing ETH, guys. Just post up your Ethereum addresses, please. And uh, we'll give it till, you know, another, let's say, five minutes. Um, we, we don't have very many people entered. So you got you got some pretty good odds right now. There are four people entered to win 0 0.2 Ethereum. Boom. And if you don't see your name on the list, I must have missed you. You gotta put your Ethereum address in the live chat. We got 34 people in here. I can't imagine no none of those 34 people or 30 of those 34 people don't want to win some Ethereum. P 
put your Ethereum address into the live chat. Nefarious Technology, thank you for joining there, buddy. So we have five entered and we have four minutes to go. It is ETH. We are doing 0 0.2 ETH, courtesy of the Mystery Man today. Thank you very much, Mr. Mystery Man. AZ Hermazario, is that how you say it? I'll just say AZ. Jonas P. Oh, Yashnik. We got you, Yashnik. If I can copy it. There we go. Yashnik. Doesn't hurt to enter. Nope. Ozzy Bogan Tech. Dan the Dane got some daring news. Going all in on crypto even after this drop in BTC. I'm signing on a new house tomorrow to be able to build and video solar and wind turbine systems to generate power for mining. Oh, that's odd. Dude, that's that's like solar and, and wind is definitely something I'm in interested in for sure. Red Panda Mining, what's up? Welcome to the live stream. We are trying to, to give away 0 0.2 Ethereum and I guess only 10 people want it. Imagine that. So all you got to do is put your Ethereum address into the live chat, like literally where you're talking. Um, just, just post it there in there, like over, I think it's, is it over? It's over there. It's on this side. Yeah. In that live chat, Jeff Malink, where do I put it? You literally put it where you typed, where do I put it? That's where you do it. Ah, uh, let's see here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a little, I got me some little mini Coca-Colas because while we're on quarantine, you know, uh, I gotta stay hydrated, you know. Ooh. And and the uh, the little run the the little ones are healthier than the big ones. Um, they have less calories and less sugar. So you just slam a couple of these, good to go. You know, logic, logic. Oh, I missed some. Hold on, Jeff Malink. Adi Calico. Red Panda, 0 0.2 ETH, oh snap, yeah, yeah, for the next couple days we're going to be 0 0.2 ETH and courtesy of the Mystery Man, only during live stream, we're not going to be doing the comment system like we did on the last giveaway, I'm sorry guys, so it's really kind of important if you want to be in the giveaways, you got to be on the live stream, so 10pm Eastern Standard Time, Monday through Thursday. Serpent, you got an RX 5700X or XT, Brandon? Have you played around with the red BIOS editor? I have. I don't have one yet. No, I don't have one. I just have the Radeon Sevens, and then everything else is pretty much Nvidia, other than the RX five seventies and four seventies. I I just can't. I I haven't got down to getting one for a good deal. Jonas P. Oh no, no problem, man. Don't thank me though. Make sure to thank the mystery man because he's the one that's putting up the money for the giveaway. Crypto nuts. The Crypto Nuts. Let's see there. Copy. Paste. Triple Three Pros. Is Coinomi being a pain there? I don't know. Nice channel, bud. In the UK, not worth mining. It, it's, as of right now, it's not exactly worth mining. It's not, I'm not going to say it's not worth mining. It's not profitable to mine uh, any anywhere local to me in the u.s because the price of the coins are so low the difficulty hasn't quite leveled off there's too many miners on the network our rewards don't match what they should um because the it just the market took a, a really hard swing it'll level out it'll make sense prices will return or difficulty will go down to make it all jive if you know what i'm saying so is it worth it i think it's worth it in the long in the long term absolutely Red Panda Mining, we got you in there. Um, means Big Brother. Savage Mine, welcome Savage Mine. How are you doing, man? Let's see here. Jeff, John Coins. Oh, and I guess I guess we're past time, so I will go ahead and enter y'all in here. And it's, it is time, it is time to pull a winner for today. 
Make sure to have your Ethereum addresses ready for tomorrow because we're going to be doing it after the live streams um, for the next for foreseeable futures. Full show. Hobbies and gadgets. Yep, I made five videos. YouTube took them down. Hobbies and gadgets. What did you make five videos about? You, did you make five videos about mining and YouTube took them down? Really? Why? What's wrong with mining? Anyway. Mike Blade says he's still making 60 cents a day mining right now. Gotta love it. Anyways, keep it up, bud. Thanks, mystery man. Courtesy of Savage Mine. Oh, we got another one. Kelly, Kelly G International. You squeaked in there right before the drawing. AZ. Nicholas Coton. Finally found some TP today. We were down to five rolls. Oh, man. nothing. Hey, it, like I've told a lot of people, it, it, it all this toilet paper talks fun and games but when you go to wipe your your hind in and you ain't got no toilet paper that's when it gets serious dan says i'm hoping to do exactly that because it's a central system being built hot air heating in the house where the mining room will heat be a part of the system filtered let's see all right that's enough ETH to buy TP. Yeah, it absolutely is. All right, guys, so we're going to do a giveaway. We have 20 people entered all the way down the list. Boom. So we're going to go to a uh, random number generator. And it's the e it's the, the Google one. And we got 20. So one is the minimum. 20 is the maximum. We're going to have a three, two, one. Oh my goodness, somebody just posted their Ethereum address. Brandon just posted his Ethereum address right before I was about to click it. Uh, I feel inclined to include you in this. You, Brandon, you literally like were, you were a, one and a half seconds away from not being entered into this. I like your name, so we're going to include you in this. So let me copy that. We'll go and put you on, you'll be in that 21st slot. We'll bump this up to 21. All right, so the polls are closed. Nobody else gets in. Thomas Brigham, to get entered, not to this one. We're done entries with this one, but to get entered, we, we're going to start doing it after these couple videos, courtesy of the Mystery Man. You're going to post your Ethereum address in the live chat, in the live chat. So and you can catch my, vi my live streams 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Monday through Thursday. So just show up here tomorrow and be ready for it. All right. So now three, two, one. All right. It was number four. Let's see who number four was. Number four was Serpent XSF. Oh, what's up, Serpent? Yeah. Okay. So a regular in the house here. Winning it. Winning it for the boys. Serpent, how you doing? Nefarious says, my wife got into a fight with her friend over toilet paper hoarding she told my wife she had 380 rolls of toilet paper for herself and her five month old what do you do with 380 rolls of toilet paper <laughs> uh, everybody's saying it's rigged if red panda wins well he didn't win guys um, uh so it's not it's not rigged but a uh, serpent oh serpent says it's rigged oh Congrats, Serpent. Um, Serpent, if you could do me a favor and drop your Ethereum address again, uh, that would be much appreciated so I don't have to go up to the live live stream and grab it, and we'll go ahead and I'll get that sent over. Yeah. <laughs> uh, thank, thank, or uh, Make sure to th put a thank you down there for the mystery man. And, um, yeah, because, I mean, it wouldn't be happening without him. So, re-roll, re nah, nah. Let's see here. Nice. Congrats to Serpent. AKS Miner. Hey, bro. What's up, man? What is up, AKS Miner? What? Stotac just subscribed. Welcome, Stotac, to the community. Baobab, too. Hello, guys. Still fun to play. Absolutely. <laughs> Red Band of Mining, here is Serpent's ETH address. I like that. 
Well, I I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna take the ETH address that he posted. Congratulations! Yeah, that that was funny, Red. All right, so let me get um let me get the old coin bases up and uh, send you some 0.2 Ethereum. Wonder what that comes out to. A little bit more than twenty bucks, I think, right now. Ethereum send. Boom. Uh, we're gonna send zero point two. That is twenty three dollars and ten cents to the winner. Now continue. Zero point two ETH network fee. I'll I'll fill y'all in on this right here. There we go. So zero point two ETH, twenty three dollars ten cents going to uh, Mr. Serpent himself. Coinbase fee zero, network fee three cents total twenty three dollars and thirteen cents. Where is my uh, second factors authentications? Let's see here. Um, nine. Okay. Yeah. Boom. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. There it is. It's on the way. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you for playing, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, and thank you, Mystery Man, for uh, sponsoring it and uh, being able to let us give back to the community. Oh, look at that. Ethereum must have went down. It's $22.96 now by the time it's sent. So, all right. You can take that 20 bucks and you can go buy your roll of toilet paper. Um, or you could get you a little bit of bitcoins or just keep it in ethereum whatever you want to do Hope you enjoy it. Don't spend it all in one place I wanted to thank everybody for coming out tonight If you want to come and chat and hang out afterwards, we're gonna be doing stuff and things over in the discord There's gonna be a link down below in the description as always. Hold on one second There we go. I, have, I keep putting it on the wrong camera um, Dan said I was talking to red panda Nefarious twenty dollars won't buy you a roll on eBay. Hmm. Let's see here. Hold on. Let's see what uh what toilet paper is going for. Uh, well, we don't want the cheapest. We want best match. What are we looking at right now? Hold on, we want some like Charmin. C H Charmin. Look at this toilet paper Charmin Essentials double soft or soft double size one roll, not the pack one roll five dollars and five dollar shipping. So ten dollars for one roll of toilet paper right there, right at the top. Um, Charmin Ultra Soft Toilet Paper. 12 super mega rolls, 72 regular bath tissue rolls, $80. What? This is getting crazy. Charmin Ultra Strong Toilet Paper Mega Rolls, 6 equals 24, $34. Wow. That's like, that's like, used to be like five bucks, didn't it? Dude, toilet paper prices are, are up. Look at this. Look, hold on. Look, look at this, this setup right here. And it's out of stock. It's out of, that means people bought them. Hold on. Do I need to go? I don't want to be that guy, but do I need to put my toilet paper up for sale? Look at this. He's selling a roll of toilet paper and a bottle of hand sanitizer for $19 and $9 shipping. That's $30. Look at rubbing alcohol. I mean, it's definitely more expensive, but I I I think there's a lot more gouge price gouging going into toilet paper. I need to get on here and undercut some people and sell it for like three dollars a roll. Sell it by the sheet. Nah, I ain't dealing with all that.
three bottle or three bottles of Clorox wipes and then a pack of Charmin toilet paper for a hundred dollars. <sighs> wow. Yeah. Oh, it's definitely worse on rubbing alcohol. Oh, I didn't know. I guess I didn't realize rubbing alcohol is only like 89 cents. I didn't, wow. Wow. The profit to be made. But I, I ain't trying to deal with that. Oh, look at this. The same bat. Look at this right here. If I'm going to be. Uh, oh, never mind. $40 with $24 shipping. This is like a um, human malware defense kit right here. You get Pine Saw, Lysol, uh, degreaser, baby wipes, a toilet paper, paper towels, Hall's defense, soap, Tide, Clorox, like a little bit of everything. That's still a ripoff though. Wow. Has any of these sold? No, okay. At 10 viewed per hour. A lot of people are thinking about buying them. If people are seriously buying those products at those prices, that is sad. It, it really is. This should be illegal. It's ridiculous. You got to be careful. That's a slippery slope, nefarious technology, because um, these people are in the U.S., the United States, and... If we start telling people what they can and can't sell items for in the private market, that's a slippery slope. Next thing you know, you're selling that car too high because I need it to get to the doctor. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I get it. Yeah, it's toilet paper, but it's a slippery slope. So, yes, this is overpriced. This is ridiculous. Uh, I don't condone it, but, you know, I, I, don't, uh, I don't agree with the uh, regulating third-party price or independent price sales so yeah anyway yeah amazon shutting stores down that do that i agree stores should not be able to actually i think it's illegal price gouging at stores or retail establishments is illegal but independent um you know joe schmo yard sale um somebody selling on ebay that's just you know their own peoples they can do it right Oh, look, Tide Pod. Nice. Hygiene and chewables. Ah. Savage Mind says he's on the fence about price gouging. If people are paying it, why not let the market decide? That is one That is one unfortunate but also fortunate thing about capitalism is um, it's a self it's a self-regulating system. If people price themselves too high and it doesn't sell, then the person gets stuck with the items. But if people are buying it, an item is only worth what people are buying. With that, with that being said, yeah. Um. Anyway. Yeah, I don't. I don't like when it's predatory either. Savage mind. Nice work on the libertarian lesson. Well done. I, I don't want to categorize myself any particular way. Uh, I just try to stay out of all that kind of stuff. Um. Anyway, I'm taking classes on how to make myself <laughs> crap less. Interesting. Hmm. Eat lots of cheese, or eat and drink water. Yeah, you could ha you could drink water and eat ice soup, right? What's the deal with the crypto market? Why are you doing it? What are you doing in crypto right now? I don't know. All right. Well, with that being said, uh, the live stream's over, guys. So um, I'm going over to Discord. If you'd like to join me. Come over to the voice chat. Make sure you got your microphone on. Make sure you're ready to, to communicate and talk with people. Hold on, what's going on? I have like random hair sticking out over here. I need to get a haircut. By the way, guys, um, I told you guys that my, my wedding is canceled. Well, it's po postponed. It's not canceled. We're going to get um, hopefully married sometime in June. So it's got pushed back a little bit. So I was telling the wife, it leaves me time to like take some hair supplement stuff. You know, shave this. Um let the mullet grow out, you know, maybe even leave the fluff in the top because a lot of people will be like, you know, shaving way too much and then, you know, not leaving enough hair. You got to have a good fluff for a good mullet to like 
have effect. You know what I'm saying? If I can, if I can work on it and like try really hard, I might be able to have a mullet in time for uh, for my wedding. Of course, she she does not want it. Bro, you there? Yeah, we there, bro. Bill Gates is airdropping BTC. That sounds not real. It's a good idea to wait to see what situation is in June, July versus now. Anyhow, I agree with that, Nefarious. At least you got your money back for the cruise. I got most of it back. I didn't get it all back, unfortunately. Double your eyebrow size. I could just be like girls and just like sharpie on. Well, not they don't. It's not sharpies, but just draw on bigger eyebrows. I heard teeth whitening is always a hindsight wish, but you look, but you look like you're good. It's okay. I mean, like there's a there's a white wall behind me, and like my teeth are almost the shade of white. You know back there or like the door maybe they're like an off-white you're making me think i need to go whiten my teeth now yeah i need to whiten my teeth okay it's real click the link bro click the link it's the microsoft channel it's live as we speak okay hold on hold on i'm not clicking the link but i'm gonna go to uh youtube microsoft Uh, the official Microsoft channel is not live right now. What is Wins talking about? I don't know. Wins, uh, the link, um, the link that you posted, YouTube, yeah, YouTube deemed it, um, no good. Yeah, sorry, man. Uh, he's trying to dox you. Yeah can't dox me bro i mean you probably could but um there's no point I, i'm broke i ain't got nothing anyway ladies and gentlemen have a good evening i've been trying to trying to get y'all off of here but you keep hanging around uh so maybe come hang out in the discord with me it's not real gates would not be giving out any crypto i don't even know if gates is like a supporter of crypto let alone if he gives it out dude open a virtual machine before going to that dude's link Oh, I don't, I don't go to people's links. Uh, if he tells me where to go, like he told me, you know, you, Microsoft YouTube live stream, then I go there and look, there's, there's nothing there. So, yeah. Batman said, time out for you wins. Come on, buddy. Spamming the channel. Heard that. Anyway, all right, guys. Peace out. Adios. Take it easy. We'll see you on the next one uh, tomorrow night, 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And uh, yeah, be there, be square, slap the likes and adios.